Hello friends, welcome back to our course Math Essential for Machine Learning and today we are going to discuss a very important and uh, a common topic called expected value of random variable. Alright, so this in this example we are going to consider a discrete random variable. Okay, so say for example you want to start a new restaurant business, right? And before you do that you want to know what can you expect to, the profit to be. So, you know, to find out what you did is you surveyed say roughly around 100 restaurants in your city and just to get an idea, you know, how much profit are they making and based on that you can make some expectations for your one. Okay, so what you did, you made a small spreadsheet, okay, and in the left column, the first column, you are just noting down the profit they are making. And in the right hand side, you are basically calculating the probability of the percentage of restaurant that are making that profit. So, the first 20% uh, of the restaurant that you spoke to are actually in loss, like they are in loss of $10,000, right? That is not a good, to, good point to start with. Um, the second, say, 30% restaurant, okay, they are. Uh, just trying to break even, they are making no profit at all, okay, the, but at least they are not in loss and say the third one, say you have 40% uh, you know, restaurant who are actually making say roughly $10,000 of profit, okay, and say what you have is now 50, 90 and say 10% percent the remaining restaurant are actually making say $50,000 profit okay so this is the information you got so our uh, random variable have four values so this is minus 10k 0 then you have positive 10k and then you have 50k right these are the expected uh, so these are the uh, random values that your random variable can uh, have okay now you want to know out of all this uh, survey, what is your expectations from your uh, restaurant business, right? So, how do we calculate this is very simple. We are going to multiply minus 10k times 0 0.2, 0 0.2 is the 20% probability that you will get this value. Then you plus 0 times 30%, of course, it is 0. Then you have positive 10k yeah, times 0.4 okay plus 0.4 is 40 percent chance that you'll make ten thousand dollar profit and then you have 50k times 0.1 right and your sum total becomes in the first case it becomes minus two thousand dollar plus then you have four thousand dollar plus and then you have five thousand dollar so what you're basically going to make is about seven thousand dollar in profit because this is plus so you're going to make a profit of seven thousand dollar so the idea behind is if your scenario is something like this that we presented so you can at least expect to make about seven thousand dollar you know if you start your own restaurant business now keep this in mind keep this in mind this seven thousand value the value itself is not part of this random variables value so uh, in real life also you can expect things to be a bit different okay so this just gives you an, a rough idea or a sense that how much are you going to make if you start a restaurant business okay now a few additional points, your expected value is always represented, in most cases is represented by like this E of x, okay, and uh, sometimes this is also known as mean of random variable, okay, and this is also sometimes represented by this mu of x, uh, alright. 
Okay, so this is all about the expected value that what you can expect out of a you know the random variable and this just gives a sense of the things that is happening around all right so i hope you have learned something new today and we'll just look into a few more concepts under probability theory and so keep practicing all this concept because this is the base for your machine learning algorithms all right so you have a great day and thanks for watching